a very impressive victory by number eight double Grand Slam. The door traverse and Getrix, Grand Finikak having a brilliant day. And uh, as with uh, at Royal Aussie, making sure that he uh, guards the right horses right home in the in the right races. But um, this filly, Grant, when you ask it to accelerate, is this the type of run that you've always expected from her throughout the season? Yeah. Um, um. That's what we thought of her, you know, the way she won today was super impressive, but we always thought highly of her. Something went wrong along the way with her. She got very skittish and very naughty. Um, but then she settled down nicely now. I think Justin got on, the, got on top of her very quickly and he's worked magic with her, I must say. He gets it right every now and again. Um, but yeah, I think it's a, but I think if Alder rode it, to be honest, she probably gets beaten or she probably stays hot, but I thank God that, uh, <laughs> The filly chose me. <laughs> and uh, chose you, she did. She did a brilliant job. Grant, well done. Nice day for you. Yeah, nice. And obviously nice for the team. Mr. Player's over here. Um, you know, not often. I, I promised the player before that he's got a very good filly on his hands. And hopefully she sees it through. And we've got a long Durban season ahead of us. And um, I, think, I think the horses will do very well. They, um, just big well done to the team. Grant, well done. You can just hold on a second to accept your mementos. Thank you to Santhan Woodley from Splash Out. Sorry, we're just doing a little bit of stage arranging. There you go. If you can accept that and have a look for your photo. Well done to Grant Finikak. Good ride. That's also yours, Grant. You've got everything to carry across. Next up. <laughs> Grant just wants his photo taken. <laughs> you can leave it there, Grant. That's fine. Justin. Grant touched on, this is what you've always believed this filly is capable of. And, and lovely to see her just do some low flying and, and really just impress everyone very much so and i uh, had a good incentive wayne player said to me well he actually said if i have three winners today so it's two but i think this might trump the three winners and offered me this this stunning cap so i'm looking forward to this moment <laughs> yeah so i said to justin before the off i said listen you've had one winner you have to have three winners to get this player hat because you're not a player yet so you need to be a player so he's got two under the under the cap is one more to go. So let's see how he looks. <laughs> Justin, you must come. Do you know what your reply is? You were born a player. Uh, oh, my wife wouldn't like to hear that, but yeah, for sure. No, but then she came along. That's what changed in your life. Yeah, very much so. And uh, just want to say, this filly, this is what she's more about. Um, I can't work out the Guineas run. It was just a disaster. And uh, we had to actually go back to the drawing board. Everyone was uh, uh, down on, on her effort. And she's just come back. And it's amazing to come back this quickly through a season to, to finish it off like this. Uh, this is late in, in our season. It's been a long one. Uh, you know, it's been a hot one. The, the climate has been fantastic for everyone that's visiting Cape Town, not if you're a racehorse. So um, I'm very happy that we're ending like this. There's still a couple more big ones still to go to Gary. Um, he was enjoying his little time off in Plet and very glad that he made that. We said, we said to him, come. Uh, it's, she's going to take a lot of beating. So get on the plane and arrive here. And uh, he's arrived here. He took Glenn, uh, 100 rand of Glen Cotton. It's a good day. Suzette and Barcy, as always, well done. And to Fastfontaine on breeding a splash out. Uh, fantastic day. Uh, it was quite funny that they sponsored the day and it was raining. And I thought, here we go. <laughs> but well done to them. It's turned out into a nice day. Justin, well done. Great, thank you very much. If you can please accept your memento, Justin. Uh, something, but Justin, you're going to come back and get your trophy. Are you going to accept uh, your trophy? There you go, Justin. Yeah, that's you. So we just uh, have a moment for Justin to have his photo opportunity and then uh, congratulations. Lovely to have Susan uh, on a course from Fast and Tain Stud. Next up, the winning connections are going to come across and uh, join me. How much is it? Mr. Play, I'm going to remind you at Hollywood Bets Durbanville, you stood with all of us presenters and you said one name, one horse, double grand slam, and here she is. Well, it's quite interesting, uh, this horse, I named it Double Grand Slam because I'm the only one in the world that won the Double Grand Slam in golf and I thought I've got to pick the best filly. And I've written a few notes here. First of all, thank you to Grant. There's always, thank you is a small word, but it's awfully important. To the Snace, what a wonderful job they've done with this horse. I was offered three million rand for this horse last week and I accepted it and they said, no, there's something wrong with the knee. I'm so happy I never sold it. <laughs> but also to the breeders, Suzanne, Susan here, you know, Fastfontaine breed very, very good horses. 
And so also to my dear partner here and her husband, and she's been a wonderful person for racing. She's put a lot of money into it. My other partner, Dave McLean, whenever I say let's buy a horse, he says go for it. So I know he's, he's watching his son play cricket today in, down in Hilton. And then also, this was a very tough field today. And so this really, she might be the best three-year-old in the country today. I'm not gonna count my chickens before they're hatched because, but I think the word is gratitude. To have a horse that can win a race like this, third in a group one, two wins, and now to win a group three. It's a thrill, big thrill. Big. Well done. Thank you very much, thank you. So is it very special win from this filly? She was so impressive. Yes, no, she was, and it's so nice to have a quick double on the day. And I just want to say thank you to Grant for a brilliant um, ride again, and to Justin for always having our horses in top shape. And um, apparently I have to bring my kids to racing because the previous race, Jill's um, daughter were here. Now Gary's son is here, so <laughs> I have to bring my kids to go have a win. <laughs> it seems like the lucky charm, so you'll have to. No, that looks like it. Thank you, Wayne, for being here. <laughs> and Thanks. also the enthusiasm by the people here is something. Enthusiasm, a very, very significant word in the world. And the enthusiasm by here to share the enjoyment with us is much appreciated. Well, enjoy the celebrations, you two. Thank you. Thank, Thank you. you. You can please, uh, so then, uh, Moodley from Splash House is going to hand over your trophy. So you can please accept your, your trophy. There you go. We'll help the celebrating along a little bit. And uh, as mentioned, well done to Susan. She is on course from Fastfontaine Stud, as well as all the team. So uh, lovely to see this daughter of Vercingetrix win a brilliant uh, race. It has been some time coming, and I know Justin dubbed her, uh, you know, a really good thing earlier on in the season. So lovely to see her uh, really find that form. She's out of that beautiful filly, Princess Peach. So number eight, double grand slam. You're winner of uh, the Splash Up Frida Cup.